Hello. This video shows the approach to set up a method in Shimadzu LCMSMS for determination of veterinary drug compounds. How do I set up my LCMSMS to detect veterinary drugs in my sample? The first step to do it is to perform MRM optimization of the target compounds on your LCMSMS instrument. Multiple reaction monitoring, often known as MRM, is a highly specific and sensitive mass spectrometry method that can selectively detect target compound from the background matrix. The red ball represents the parent ion of your target compound, the rest of the blue balls represent background matrix. When the sample enter mass spectrometer, both target ion and background matrix enter Q1, Q1 parameter is set in a way that only target ion can travel through Q1 into Q2. Then, collision-induced dissociation takes place in Q2. Parent ion is fragmented into several daughter ions. Finally, Q3 parameter is set in a way that only selected daughter ion can travel through Q3 to reach the detector. The final signal is displayed as a peak in MRM chromatogram. Let's check what should we do to set up an MRM method. Firstly, we have to identify the target compound. With basic information of the target compound, we will be able to identify the parent ion. Subsequently, daughter ions can be selected to form different MRM transitions. Thereafter, mass spectrometer parameters such as collision energy, Q1 pre-bias and Q3 pre-bias have to be optimized to achieve best result. To begin setting up method for detection of veterinary drugs in LCMSMS, basic information of the target veterinary drugs including formula, structure and molecular mass are listed. The following diagram shows the MRM optimization process of a veterinary drug, sulfaquinoxaline. Molecular weight of SQX is 300.3402. Parent ion of SQX with mass to charge ratio of 301.1 was identified through Q1 scan. Subsequently, the parent ion under underwent fragmentation in Q2 to produce daughter ions. Three daughter ions with highest intensity were selected from Q3 scan to form three MRM transitions. Lastly, collision energy, Q1 pre-bias and Q3 pre-bias, were optimized for each transition to obtain best sensitivity. MRM optimization can be time-consuming, especially when we are setting up multi-analytes analysis method. MRM optimization in Shimadzu's LCMS systems is based on a rapid series of automated flow injection analyses, requiring only minutes to perform. Multiple compounds can be optimized in an unattended sequence. Optimized parameters will then be saved as MS method, freeing the analyst from tedious work. Let us look at the procedure to perform automated MRM optimization using lab solutions. First, create a new method file. Input value for interface parameters, acquisition time, pump parameters and oven temperature. Then, download the method to the instrument. Press the optimization for method button at the left panel to begin the automated MRM optimization. Remember to name and save your method file. Enter basic information of the five veterinary drugs to the table. Don't forget to indicate the position of your vial in the table too. Select the output folder where your method file will be saved. All optimized MRM transitions and parameters will be automatically saved to this method file when the optimization is completed. You may edit the parameters to be optimized or the product ion selection criteria. Press the start button when all are ready. During the optimization process, optimization status will be shown on the screen. Once optimization is done, you can check the result details by pressing the details button. The optimized results are updated in the method file automatically. The next step is to set up LCMSMS quantitation method based on the optimized MRM method to build calibration curve. Three key components including LC parameters, MS parameters and data processing parameters will be set up for LCMSMS quantitation method. By using the LCMSMS method, an automated batch run will be conducted to build the calibration curves for standard. First, we will install the LC column. Next, the LC gradient method will be set up for the separation of all compounds in a mixture. 
and other MS parameters are input for the acquisition method. The LC gradient method and other MS parameters are input for the acquisition method in real-time analysis window of lab solutions. With this developed LC MSMS method, an automated batch run will be carried out for calibration standards. After the data acquisition finished, the data files with calibration curves can be reviewed in Lab Solutions Insight software. Let's look at the overlay of the chromatograms of calibration standards for sulfaquinoxaline. The calibration curves for the five compounds with good linearity were generated by Lab Solutions Insight software. R square value above 0.997 was achieved. In order to save time and method development, I recommend you use Shimadzu Ready to use LCMSMS method package for veterinary drugs. The package includes methods for simultaneous analysis of 129 veterinary drug compounds. Skip the tedious MRM optimization and LC method setup procedures, all you need to do is to load the ready to use method into your instrument and select the veterinary drug compounds of your interested. Thereafter, you are ready to run your samples. For further information of the method package, kindly refer to the link provided in this video description. Excellence in Science. Shimazu.